What's up everybody, Mr. Frags here from ArmageddonGaming.com This is the Super Mario Galaxy 2 walkthrough This is the Puzzle Plant Galaxy and this is the first star, the Puzzling Picture Block Um, now, I chose the Puzzling Picture Block But, this isn't the Puzzling Picture bro Block Try saying that ten times fast This is the hidden star for this level and this one can be very easy to miss because you need 70 coins by the time you get up to one of the earlier planets. And you pretty much have to find all the hidden coins and not miss any of them before they disappear. So, you can start off by getting most of these star bits. And then ground pound on that whenever you're ready. To kill these guys, you just gotta ground pound near them and they're gonna flip on their back. Now the bottom right star, or the bottom right button over here activates the launch star to the next planet. But don't take that yet, instead activate all the other buttons. One's going to give us some star bits, right there. The top right one's going to give us some coins, and the top left one is going to give us some of those musical notes. And that's just going to give us a couple of 1-ups, but hey, I'm not going to turn down any 1-ups. So just follow these in the pattern they appear in. Uh, you should have no problem. Gives you enough time as long as you don't get off the path of the notes. If you do kind of stutter a little bit, uh, you might miss them, but you can see I did just fine there. And then take the launch star to the next planet. And this is going to be the planet that the hidden Luma is on, or the Luma that get, turns into the hidden stars on. So ground pound that one to the left as soon as you land for some coins. Follow these all the way up and don't get hit like that. That's a very easy waste of a coin because if you haven't been able to tell, any coin that uses, uh, replenishes the thing of health uh, doesn't count towards your total coin count. So there's going to be a couple in this hidden, well not hidden, but there's going to be a couple hidden ones in this bush. If you go up here, you're going to be able to attack this guy for a coin. And try not to get that as soon as I did because you see a few fell off the edge. But it shouldn't be much of a problem as long as you act quick. But we got those. And then head into this pipe and this is where we're going to get the majority of our coins. As soon as you activate the star a bunch of coins are going to spawn. It's going to be one wave of coins but uh, the triplet form that they're in makes it kind of hard to get them all in a straight line. So just do your best and pick up as many as you can. You really need to get most if not all of these coins. So if you follow the pattern I did, you should be able to do it just fine. But there's my 70. So we're going to go talk to that hungry Luma. And he's going to transform into the plant with the hidden star on it. So he's right here. Just talk to him and feed him 70 coins. And now he'll transform into a large star and a planet that you can use the launch star to go over to. Now this hidden star is the kind of the first hidden star that requires you to fight a boss type person. Uh, but this boss is fairly easy. We're still using the cloud power ups as you can tell. And we're going to be using the cloud power ups to deal with this boss. So come over to this platform and as soon as you step foot on it, a uh, cutscene's gonna kind of activate and this guy's gonna jump down. Now to kill this guy, all you have to do is uh, do a ground pound, I think that's what it's called when you jump and press Z. Yeah, it's called a ground pound. Uh, off a cloud, so just create a cloud and jump when you're over his back and just use the shadow to tell when you're over his back. Once you see your shadow on his back, uh, hit Z and you'll jump down and hurt him. You have to do this three times. Uh, for the last two times, I suggest doing a ground pound on this spring right here. And creating a cloud up here and just waiting for him to pass. He's just going to do the same back and forth pattern. And the last time, he's just going to be a little bit angry. But he keeps the same flying pattern pretty much. He just goes a little bit faster. But once you get his third time on him, he'll transform into the star. And you'll have your hidden star for this galaxy.